lately I've been doing a, like, a lot more photo shoots. And this upcoming photo shoot is going to be the sand dudes are burning like a piano. I don't want to talk to you guys to help you like figure out how to get a lot of people in the group chat. Because currently I have like maybe like 100 people in this group chat. We are indeed starting a new series and it's called Wake Up and Yap. Where you guessed it. I'm going to be waking up and I'm going to just be yapping. Uh, damn, there's like a light that's hitting my eyes just perfectly. Cool, 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 cool. Maybe this room will help. I don't even know. Oh, man. I just want to do this so that when I wake up, I just start talking about something. Oh, my gosh. So, I'm inviting a lot of photographers, videographers. And I notice I'm doing like all the right things for, I don't know, what you would call it, like sales or marketing or whatever. But it happened naturally because it feels like a passion. Like I remember I was in real estate, like like talking to everyone and their mom was like, I'm a real estate agent, it was not fun. But saying I do videography and photography is super fun. And so like I'm naturally like texting a billion people. I'm naturally like I'm giving everyone invites. I'm naturally like <laughs> talking to like everyone and their mom and telling them what's happening, which is super cool. Ready? And that's something you're supposed to be doing anyway, like for sales, just so you can get better sales. So side note. Anyways, uh, if you're in like a school, which I happen to be in school, um, there's like a U of U 2026 Snapchat group chat. And that's where I've been getting a lot of like people. I've also been going out. Obviously, I go out like pretty often. Just meeting new people and just inviting them to creating new friends, making new friend groups and getting all those people into the Snapchat group chat. I also made a little... PDF document on my phone that has like the frequently asked questions so that people understand what's going on in this Snapchat group chat. I also make sure that people don't spam the chat because if everyone spams the chat, people leave. So it's like, where are we meeting? What time are we meeting? Uh, what time are we leaving? Where are we going? What outfit should I bring? What else should I bring? Uh, what should I do next? That kind of stuff, like super easy questions to help people understand like what is going on. So where are we meeting? Can I hitch a ride with someone? What do I bring? What do I wear? Those kinds of things. And it makes it super easy to get everyone in a group chat. Now it's time for logistics. Uh, usually when it comes to logistics and like getting props and getting items like that, they kind of just show up. If I'm being so real, like once you start putting together all this other stuff, like right now we have this girl named Olive who's saying that we could probably get some costumes from a theater that she works in. This piano is a bunch of free piano stuff uh, in Salt Lake City. Finding a truck, someone's gonna have a truck, it's just gonna make sense. Uh, I feel like with those photo shoot stuff, oh my gosh. I feel with all this like photo shoot stuff, a lot of it just tends to like work out, uh, even if it doesn't, because I think my main goal with all of it is just help other people make lifelong friends make friends meet new people hang out have a good time like the 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 photos are really like a side effect to be honest i'm trying to see if yeah and so i think the couple of words that have been scaring people like the word model or photographer or yeah like titles really scare people these days i think everyone's like really really afraid of like big titles and stuff like that so when it's when you're inviting people especially when they're not like actual models or professionals anything it's like really good to specify like hey we're just having a good time and like the side effect is taking photos and i've just started to notice like i've read a lot of books on like building a culture or building like rules or whatever and it never really made sense but now i'm trying to see it like if i'm starting a company right now i've got to like set up some ground rules and what are the goals and like if people are being rude to each other what do you do it's a lot of leadership stuff which is really interesting very glad that i've gotten a lot of that leadership experience um <laughs> because yeah it's super fun well that's all i really got if you want to start taking photo shoots and doing crazy stuff go out on facebook marketplace find some random shit go to a random location and invite everyone and their mom <laughs> All right, well, that was a good morning. I love you. Cheers.